Hi everybody, this is Konstantin Weinfeld, I'm back on YouTube and this is a new harmonica lesson on the song called do si do by Diplo featuring Blanco Brown. So for those who don't know, Diplo is one of the most popular music producers out there right now and I'm a big fan so I was very happy to discover his latest EP on Spotify a few weeks ago and on there was this song called do si do with a harmonica hook in it and I was very happy about this and eager to find out um, who the harmonica player was on this record. Um, so it took some time for me to find out, but now I know that it was Will Wilde. Um, you should definitely check him out. He has great videos on YouTube. And my first idea was to just record a YouTube tutorial for this little hook. So here we go. Um, everything we need right in my hand here. So this is a an A harmonica, um, no autofocus today, and we are playing in second position in the key of E. So this is just the most popular key we can play in, especially if we play together with a guitar. So this is a guitar song, so it all makes sense. Again, this song was released a few weeks ago, so I knew that if I wanted to record this harmonica tutorial, I had to produce the whole song again. Um, to have a backing track, right? Um, so that's a lot of work, but I actually did that and also we called it a little video for Instagram together with a great bassist. Um, her name is Julia Hofer, she's from Vienna, Austria, and she also records great videos for the music store Toman, um, which you can check out if you're interested in bass. Um, and you should check out the video. I will show it in the end of um, this tutorial too. But um, check it out on Instagram and leave a comment if you like. So let's go. Let me play the main riff for you once. I will slow it down a little. <laughs> That's the whole thing. So let's take this apart. We're starting out with our draw chord on the A harmonica. So we are drawing holes 1, 2 and 3 at the same time. Actually we are focusing on holes 1 and 2 and this one has a lot of impact. At the same time we want to make sure that we don't breathe too much air in and use too much strength because then we sound like like this and the tone thins out a little. So we still want to keep like the big embouchure here. Um, that's the first chord. <coughs> right after that we are switching our embouchure and we're not playing a chord anymore but we are rather switching to our lip pursing technique and play the two hole blow um, which is a C sharp on the A harmonica. <coughs> right after that we are drawing through the same hole and playing two hole draw which is an E. And again I'm articulating this note, so I'm saying DA through the instrument, playing two hold draw. <coughs> so you really want to make sure that you touch the upper part of your mouth with your tongue. <coughs> and right after that we are basically faking a tongue slap. Um, we are playing two hole draw again, but we have a little grace note in advance, which is the whole chord. So I'm starting out with the big mouth playing three holes at the same time, and then I'm very quickly switching to the pucker technique, and I'm only playing two hole draw. So you can actually fake tongue blocking a little bit, um, but it won't sound as strong as tongue blocking, of course. Um, but within this little riff, I think this is how it's done. So um, it makes a lot of sense to go with lip pursing here. So that's the first part. Up until now this is very very rhythmic and not too melodic. We are only playing holes 1, 2 and 3. Um, 
Now we are getting into the melodic part, but still, we are playing double stops here. After playing this little fake tongue slap, we are moving on with the three whole half step band, which is a G on the A harmonica. That's the main melody note we want to focus on, but at the same time, we want to get a little bit of bluesiness in there and some dirt, so some of the air is moving through whole four. Basically like two-thirds of my air is moving through hole three and one-third is moving through hole four um, You can start out practicing this by just playing three hole draw and four hole draw naturally So this note should be your main melody note and Then you can start to bend the note down until you get the half step bend and you want to keep the sound of the four hole draw in there That's the sound you want to get. <laughs> right after that, we only play the four hole blow. Um, lip first, very easy. A harmonica, that's an A. <laughs> so that's like smoke on the water, right? <laughs> With this note, I think you can decide if you want to play four hole blow naturally or if you rather want to keep the double stop on Bruce and play four hole blow with a little bit of five hole blow in there. I think both are fine. So that's a loop. I think this little riff gets repeated three times. For the fourth time, we are going into a double stop on hole four and five, um, which we are actually starting on the full half step band, and we are letting it up. This is something I would call maybe like a slow scoop. We are really like wailing through the instrument here. We are letting it up completely until we reach like the natural four hole draw while keeping the five-hole draw in our mouth with like one-third of the air moving through it. And then we're going to uh, sing a note and play the four-hole half-step band and move down or with a slide down over the three-hole draw to two-hole draw, naturally. And what I hear in the actual recording is a little ghost chord after that. So it's one, two, three, draw. But it's very quiet um, with a lot of air. Before going to the two hole draw naturally again. And again, the two hole draw, I'm actually articulating that saying down through the instrument. And after that, the last two notes are following. Which are again the two double stops. Three hole draw half step band together with the four hole draw and then the four hole blow maybe together with the five hole blow. So... So that's the whole thing. Um, the main riff repeated three times and then we have this little thing going to the four hole draw Scoop, double stop, together with five hole draw, sliding down to two hole draw, and then playing the two double stops again. That's the whole loop for the hook. Another melody in this piece is a whistle melody, which is uh, built from the notes of the blues scale. And I will also just tap this one out here and play it for you now. <laughs> As you can tell, there's a lot of articulation involved, 
um, and also I really like to play the four hole bow as an octave, including the one hole bow. So I have holes one, two, three, and four in my mouth, and I'm covering holes two and three with my tongue. And I use the rolled R, like the Spanish one, um, in front of it as a little grace note, grace sound. I find this very effective. Um, I really like the effect. Maybe you want to try this too. So these are the two melodies in this song. Um, we can play both of them very well on the harmonica. Um, in our version I included a little pickup line which I can also tab out for you. Um, I played it pretty fast. I would say it's just a little ear catcher for everyone listening to it on Instagram before the main thing. Um, it lays out pretty well on the harmonica so I will also just tab it out here and play it want for you um, at a slow tempo. <laughs> That's the whole thing. I'm ending on a split between holes two and five and I'm letting the band fall down on hole two while keeping the natural 5 hole draw in the right side of my mouth. I think that's everything I can tell you about the melodies in this song. Um, if you enjoy it, maybe you want to try it yourself and record yourself. I would be glad to hear your recordings of this. You can send them to honalife at konstantinweinfeld.com. Um, I'm doing the next Hona live stream together with uh, Rachel Plas from Paris, um, France, on Thursday at 9 p.m. Central European Summer Time. So make sure to tune in on the Hona YouTube channel. Really looking forward to that. Also, um, the live stream after that will be together with Greg Slap from Paris. So it's a French month. <laughs> <laughs> also, if you want to stay updated on the things I do, I think the best platform to follow me on is Instagram. So this is my account. Also linked in the description box below. And if you're interested in private harmonica lessons, you can contact me directly through Skype. And I also offer harmonica lessons via Zoom and FaceTime now. If that's interesting for you, just write me an email, maybe through my website. That's also a way to contact me. For all German viewers, um, I just founded a little Discord server called Harmonicats, where we can talk about harmonica and all things music related. You can check out the server below if you click the invite link. And yeah, I hope you enjoyed this little video. Please let me know if you liked it or not by giving the video a thumbs up or down. Um, let me know if you have questions, write a comment and I hope to see you soon. Um, maybe I can include the little video I shot with the bassist here. Um, if not, you should check it out on Instagram. Have a good day or a good evening wherever you are. Bye. Uh, uh, do -si -do.